Welcome to the World Tarot. This is the series Divine Masculine Diaries for the 28th of April 2023. Before I get into the reading, I have a message for anyone watching, male or female. When you see people, actors specifically, being sacrificed in the movies, if they get shot and killed or you see them in a casket or they, you see them getting buried, that's a ritual sacrifice. Confirmation with the noise. That's a ritual sacrifice of said actor. Their souls are being sacrificed and they don't even know it, some of them. Right. Holy Spirit, show me what Divine Masculine needs to hear today. Chosen ones. Somebody's a chosen one. They chose one person to be sacrificed also. So somebody's going to be tricked into acting as an actress. Acting as an actress. Yes, somebody might not even be a professional actress. That's what I'm getting. But they're going to be acting as an actress. <laughs> okay, there we go. So, uh, possibly a Pisces, a Libra, a Taurus, an Aries. Uh, could be asked to uh, play some kind of part in a movie where they're supposed to die. But they don't really die, but their soul will die. Because these people are actually sacrificing the person's soul. Oh, you're just starring in a video or a movie. It's so cool. Mm-hmm. As if. Pisces, Cancer could be highlighted here. You see, it looks like the same character. Somebody could actually look like this. Who might be sacrificed in a video or movie. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces or Cancer. Could be Scorpio too. And this could be Aries, Taurus. This could be Aries, Libra. Somebody could be 40. Somebody could be 29, somebody could be 44 in, involved in this, maybe even 23. Somebody could be born on the 7th of July specifically, or in 1977. The 23rd, February and March could also be significant, and September and April. Right. Who are they trying to sacrifice in the video? Uh, yeah, it could be a Cancer or a Pisces who's 34. Could be an earth sign too. Eight. Eileen Rip from the sun. Could be somebody born in August. Could be a Leo or a Virgo. Twelve. The wise old lady. The 12th of August. That's in Leo season. The 8th of December is in Sagittarius season. Could be a fire sign. Fire and water specifically here. 29. Almirage. Could be a Capricorn born on the 29th. 29 came out twice. So there's definitely somebody born on the 29th who's in danger. They could also be born on the 2nd of September or the 9th of February. So Virgo and Aquarius could also be significant. Virgo again, or Gemini, or I almost said Taurus, but I meant to say Aries. 9, 2, 9, 9. Somebody could have a 9 life path. 18 breaks down to 9, too. Stone fist. They could be sacrificing an older man or an older woman, too. So a whole group of people is dying in a video, possibly. Or in a movie. Eight, Capricorn. I stuttered. There could be a Capricorn female born on the 29th. Also, some, look, 8-8. Eight, eight. I saw 8-8 eight, eight on a billboard today. Somebody could be born in 88. They're sacrificing somebody born in 1988. That person would be 34, around 34 now. 33? No, sorry. 35. 34 and turning 35, maybe. Yes. Somebody in their early 30s, possibly 34 or 33. Aries energy. Look, 29th of April. They're planning to do this tomorrow on the 29th of April. Somebody's birthday could also be 29th of April, possibly. That Taurus. I said Taurus here instead of uh, Aries. 24. 24th of April. Something happened on the 24th of April. I was talking about, uh, yesterday I was talking about the man who may have felt very ill. He was okay on the 22nd of April, 
and he was ill by the 24th of April. This could be a man who sacrifices people, or he might be sacrificed himself. So there's a man who's been feeling ill since the 24th. Look, this is my death card, 13. 25, the gargoyle. He could be vomiting. He could be losing weight. His belly, there's something wrong with his belly. He feels like puking. Puking. To the whole egg. Revenge. So this could be karma. This could be something coming back to him. That's why it's revenge. This man could be sacrificing animals. And the souls of animals are coming back after him to take revenge. Also, there's this woman who summons hellhounds. So this woman could be sending something towards this man. And it's affecting him because he has karma. Yeah, it yeah, Libra energy. Somebody could have blue or green hair or white hair. Could be an older woman or somebody who dyes their hair in pastel colors. Who's doing this to this man could be his wife or who knows what else they are to him somebody close to them the Empress B yeah their wife is doing this <sighs> right the troll so their wife is their troll basically also he could be a troll both him and the wife could be trolls but now they're trolling each other and the wife wants to take him out free, the mother of the woods. 23rd of March could be significant. Could be the man's birthday possibly. His wife is a witch. She's asking him to use some kind of herbal remedies or who knows what else. Ta-da! Oh, I'm very nurturing. I'm taking care of you. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> 23rd or 22nd could be somebody's birthday. March could be somebody could be born in March, possibly. Or February or June. The devil. <laughs> oh, 26th of September, that's Libra season. So we've got Pisces and Libra here. Prince Charming, Gemini. Aquarius, Pisces, Libra, Capricorn. So what's the video about? Who's making a video? Who's making a video about people dying? My head is itching. Who, the sea lion, is making a video about people dying? Could be a Leo and a Pisces. Or a Leo with Pisces in their chart. Or a Cancer Leo cusp. The youngest son, 35, somebody will be 35. I said 35 earlier by mistake, even though there was no 35. 42, the star. 11, the magic whistle. And 25, 5, Leah. So there could be a marriage happening too. 5 to 5, it's an impending union. So four weddings and a funeral days. <laughs> Tower moment, Scorpio energy. The Kraken, 23. Again, somebody's born on the 23rd. The sea lion. Yeah, it could be somebody on the cusp, right? Of water and fire. Born on the 23rd. Making videos. Of bullshit. When they're actually sacrificing people without their knowledge. They're very cheeky. I called this person cheeky before. Cheeky boys. Right. The, the Cheeky Girls was a very lame band made of two twin twin sisters. Anyway, it was here in the UK. Maybe this person's from the UK. Kanotila 20, 2023. The stalker just fell off the video. They want to bury somebody, yes, ritualistically. This is the healer wants to bury somebody ritualistically. Somebody has a lot of tattoos or they make spiritual tattoos on them. Fifteen, Sarah. We've got 15th of March here again, hello. 26, Diana the Fairy, somebody's born on the 26th. 48, the Righteous Cold One, 
somebody could be born in 48 or the 8th of April or the 4th of August. Somebody could be an Aquarius or any water sign. The troll. <laughs> yeah, the troll. Hello, troll. <laughs> Le troll. Okay, somebody could be French or a French descent. The castle in the north, 25. 39 in Kanyamba. Oh, yeah, <laughs> the troll is being trolled. Oopsie, serious from the sky. 13. Somebody could be a podcaster, a musician, a public speaker, a politician. Scorpio energy, Cancer. 13th of April. Somebody's born on the 13th of April. What business do you have with these people? They sacrificed your favorite singer. 27, Simmer. 27th of April. 27 twice. Yes, today's the 27th. Today's the day. 10, Stone Fist. When they're going to be sacrificing a group of people in a video. So they're sacrificing their souls, even though these people are going to still be alive. Maybe they'll be alive, but lately we've been seeing that uh, sometimes they put actual weapons on set with actual bullets on them. <laughs> so sometimes it's not just the ritual, it's not just the soul that goes, it's the body too. Uh-huh, exactly, fire, fire. Fire in the hole, 14 and 18. Somebody born on the 18th and somebody born on the 14th might need to hear this. Okay, I gotta go now. 14th of January. Capricorn.